I'm gonna show you some of my favorite background eraser apps. And if you don't know what those are, that's an app that allows you to load a photo inside of it and delete or erase part of the image that you don't want, leaving only what you want. For example, if you wanna cut yourself out so you can use it on top of a YouTube thumbnail or maybe inside of your channel art, these apps can help you do that. And I have apps for both Android and iOS users, and I'm gonna let you know which app works on which platform by adding a little icon when I mention the app that's gonna look like this. And if you're new to the channel, welcome. If you wanna learn how to make better content with your phone or you wanna be a mobile YouTuber, be sure to hit the subscribe button followed by the notification bell so you don't miss out on future videos. So the first app that we're gonna talk about is an app you've probably heard about or maybe you already have it on your phone and that's called PixArt. PixArt is an all-in-one app. You can do cutouts, you can make thumbnails, you can crop, it has filters, it has beauty features so you can take care of blemishes and change your skin tone and all of that. It is a powerhouse of an app. I highly recommend trying this app out if you're not already using another app that can do all these things. You can literally do everything start to finish, channel art, thumbnails, cutouts, you name it, you can do it on this app. Now before I move on to the next app, I wanna hear what apps you're currently using to make your YouTube thumbnails with or your YouTube channel art. So go down, leave a comment below. You know I read every single question and comment and I reply to as many of them as possible. And when this video is over, I'm gonna go down there and carry on the discussion. Moving right along to an app called Background Eraser or just Eraser. This is a very powerful app, it has an auto feature or you can manually do it. That's all this app does. Now, you do have to zoom in and you do have to change the size of the brush and that can be a little awkward at first, but it's super powerful once you get to do it. It's a fantastic app. And once you save the image, it saves it out in a transparent PNG the way all these other apps do. And you can use another app that they have called Photo Layers that allows you to use multiple layers that you used in the other app and you can save them and build them up in layers. And that is a really powerful feature if you wanna get a little creative with your cutouts. Now, before I move on to the next app, App, I do wanna mention something about these apps in case you've never used them before. They are a little bit clunky and they're kind of awkward at first, but like anything else, the more you use it, the more you practice with it, the better you will get. So your first couple of cutouts might not look that good, but I promise you, if you keep at it, they're gonna look awesome. Next up is another all-in-one powerhouse app and that's called Pixomatic. Pixomatic can do everything, including cut yourself out. You can add text, you can crop, you can add filters. You can make your YouTube thumbnails with this app by itself. So this is a free app. It's an awesome app, download it, check it out, and see if it works for you. Next up is an app called Exacto. Now this is an unbelievably powerful app. It does one thing and it does it incredibly well. In my opinion, it does it better than all the rest because with all the other apps, you actually have to use a brush or some sort of a pen tool and draw it around or use the brush and trace around it. But with this one, it works a little bit differently. It actually adds precision points. So you zoom in and you add dots around your image that you wanna cut out and those dots are movable. So when you add all the dots around the image, then you can delete the rest of the picture and it is a precision cutout. In my opinion, this is hands down the best background eraser out there. It's more like a cutout tool than it is a background eraser, but this app is not free. But if you want the absolute best cutouts, this is the one you wanna get. Now there's something else that I wanna to mention to you when using these apps. They export the image into a transparent PNG file. That means that the graphic app or photo app that you're currently using to make your designs with, they have to be able to import a transparent image in order to see through the background that you erase. Now off the top of my head, in addition to the two apps that we already talked about today that are the all-in-one apps, I know Pixelmator will do this as will InShot, but you're gonna to have to import these into your favorite app and see if it works for you. If not, you might have to change apps to get one that can see through the backgrounds that you delete in these apps. Next up is a very simple and easy to use eraser and it's called Magic Eraser. It just does the one thing, it's easy to use. The auto feature is actually really powerful, but you gotta play with it to kind of figure it out a little bit. Now, be warned, it does have ads that pop up. So when you see an ad for like booking.com come, just look for the X somewhere on the top or the bottom. You can tap on that and close the ad. So be warned about that. Otherwise, it's a really fun and powerful app to use. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. If this is your first time here, be sure to hit that subscribe button followed by the notification notification bell if you want to make better content on your phone or you want to become a mobile YouTuber. And I will see you in the next video.